country, my people. Buja, hello and welcome to Wadandi and Buja. We're going to the caves now, Kingi Caves, an ancient lands experienced. Odos. They call them formations. The cave formations, yeah. Okay. Yeah. Okay. Um, nice. There's lots in Nilgi caves. Yeah, we've been here before. These are our friends they're visiting oh, from. Okay. Yeah, so we're just bringing them to sort of yeah. see the place. One's from Gold Coast, oh, cool. and the two are from Kenya. So. Oh, nice. Yeah, so we're from Perth. So Is come there down. caves in Nilgi? We do. We don't have formations, though. Yeah. We have lots of caves. They can be dark. Yeah, but we don't have formations like this one, so it's going to be an experience for them. Dryer. It is tropical. tropical yeah, right. so we don't get like winters, or but we get the short rains, the long rains. Yeah. And they can be humid as well. Yeah, so. like wet and dry season? Yeah, yeah, wet and yeah. dry. Okay. Mm. Oh, wow. So lots of safari and the likes, but not much caves. So. Yeah. Oh, this yeah. is something different. <laughs> yeah, I hope they like it. Yeah. We loved it the last time we were here, so we hope yeah. they'll like it. So. Yeah. Will be worth the drive. Yeah, mm. from Perth. Yeah, from yeah. Perth. Yeah. Maybe I headed back. So we'll see how we go. Yeah. Thanks. This is cute. I'm sure yeah. it's expensive. I'm sure it's not cheap. Look, it's thirty nine dollars. Look, it's so pretty. If you had got a big one and you framed it, it would be so cute. This is the gift shop. Lots of souvenirs. Lots of things to take home. Ready to go? Come on, let's go, guys. to the caves 500 million years ago 400 million years ago 300 million years ago 1 2 3 4 5 6 7 8 2 3 4 5 6 7 8 3 4 5 6 7 8 4 5 6 7 8 5 6 7 8 7 8 8 Salt water and forest people with a strong connection to the sea. 50,000 years. Oh, yes, and me. Yes, and me. How many years? That. Make it rain. Let's try and make it rain. Hmm? 
We have to practice. It has rained. Now we can go. Oh, no, I think it's trying to explain how the rocks form because that lady told me. I think initially they are. She said the name, the material of the caves, and then the, when the water came, it is the one that caused the formations to form. Oh, they're on holiday. <laughs> you see they're trying to rehabilitate this place they're preserving the wood <laughs> It's tough on me. It's tough on me. Soon. I think I got a headache. Who's me getting it? Mm -hmm. We are entering the caves. Ah, we get in the money wilderness. I am the last one of those. Mom's your gopper. Walk down to it. Oh, someone's taking photos. Come on, gopper, There's space. Oh, I'm in a car, Nini. Mushroom. Up on a Japanese exercise, by the way. These are the Australian flowers, the natives we call them. This is the Maori, Bruno. Comes up in February and March. Come with me. You're gonna see the Birak. Birak. Oh, it's birak. not Birak. This is the Birak. Mm -hmm. December to January, natives. That's your birthday. Oh, it's yeah, my birthday. And Jenny. Sisi etu ni pale pasi. Come around. Come around. So, the pink fairy orchid. Mm. October, November. October, um, November. About now, right? Uh, next month. Oh, come on. Come on. But they have their they have their native word. How they say Cumberland. This one's pretty. It's very pretty. It's getting it warmer. It tells us it's getting warmer. Soon time to get the fishing rod out and head to the coast. It's the wattle. The rigid wattle. 
Makuru, Wakiluya, and Makuru. Makuru in English is a cocky star. So it's come out like this, making the What's a cocky? Pakistan, Indige bush. I love first guest of Makuru. Happens in June to July. Yeah, okay. Almost there. Almost there. Okay. June this is, is my favorite, part. guys, by the way. This one's very nice. That's your favorite. There you are. Yeah. Yeah. This one. Yeah. This one's going to be very, very beautiful. Right. Yeah. Yeah. If you put it in a, in, in a vase or like flower arrangements when you buy them, they can be quite costly. Mm. This one's, but... Um, they're very nice. They're very beautiful. Mm -hmm. Gerard, mm -hmm. April and May. Mm -hmm. So oh, yeah. these are the native flowers mm -hmm. of Australia. Mm -hmm. Can be very, very costly to buy, but they last long. You can keep them in a flower vase much longer. Even when they dry up, they can remain there for much longer. Especially this one. This one I've seen it for sure. <coughs> it's good. The tongue may not. But the tongue, of course, is the tongue moist. even the water will fall off. But this <laughs> one, <laughs> the room is moist. Did I see something like this somewhere? Mm. Is that yeah, what we saw? Yes, yeah. yeah. All right. Mm. Yeah, this I one is a very common one. Mm. It's a very uh, beautiful flower. I love it. it. This one sounds like Nakuru. Makuru. 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 And you, because you're going to come and visit if you haven't. This is how the discovery happened. Dawson, we talked about Edward Dawson, an old man, 38 years. Look at him. That's how initially it was. Mm -hmm. You see? Okay. Uh, and then when they discovered it, they protected the authorities were encouraged to promote cave tourism. Of course, then they had to improve access and keep visitors safe. Yes. And then they put up a protective trap door, they put up stairs, banisters, candles, lanterns, magnesium wire. Mm -hmm. You see? In 1918, people started visiting a lot of them. That's Look at this boy, 18, he yes. visited. This girl visited. You see? Mm. You have to visit. Mm. Okay, getting here. How did people get here? <coughs> eh? People used to use this thing. Sorry, tourist <laughs> parlor. <laughs> parlor coach, and then they traveled 30 kilometers to the cave from Basilton. Okay? Mm. So it was initially bad roads, but then the improvements were made. Okay, and then the cave house. Now it was upgraded, then it was upgraded. Okay, woman, let's see, what was the story here? She became a cave woman, did she stay here? Oh, she has been in the, the wow. Okay. Oh, she stayed there for 30, she did 90 days 90 in the days. cave. Yeah. All for a day. So done, yeah. And then uh, these pictures, they look even better in person, guys. Even better in person, I tell you. Very well illuminated. You need to have some form of ability to exercise because you're going to go up these stairs and go down. So if you can't go uphill, probably not. Okay. These are the Aboriginal people. I think they're teaching how to light a fire. What is this horn of theirs called? Mm -hmm. The horn has a name. I can't remember. Mm. Okay. Mm. I think it has a name. I forgot the name. And this is your way out. I'll show you. And as you come out, the cave people are very, you know, they've actually left a message for us, thanking us for coming and reminding us of the heritage. So, come on. Wandandi people, the salt water people, they lived here and we spent time on their land. So we respect their land. Their elders past, present and emerge. We're going out now into the gift shop and into the parking. So 
beans. Red beans. This is the way out. That was the entrance. And this is the gift shop. You can give a souvenir for your loved ones from here. Original art. Very beautiful. Aboriginal stuff. Very beautiful. This ones, I really love. Very nice. Okay, you can get one and you can put it in a frame. Look at the price. It's about sixty dollars, but it's very beautiful. They have, they do it really well. They do. I love their art. I love it. Do you like the clips? Absolutely, absolutely. Really enjoyed it. Very Mama Shani, come and see. Oh, my thing. Mm, this is your area. So good at that one. So this is it. We've had a lovely time out here. The caves. Southwest region is just it for me. I love this region. It's nice and airy. The weather is beautiful. The people are warm and lovely. It's just nice. It's just nice being in the southwest region. You're just not thinking of anything. You're just in the bush hearing the noise. Can you hear the birds? Do you guys hear? Can you hear? It's just so nice. You can just forget yourself in the Southwest region. So yeah, hopefully you guys had a lovely time with us. I'm gonna sit up down there and talk to you a little bit more. Can we tell them about the price? So if you come here, if you get into the caves, it's $32. For seniors, it's $30. For kids, it's 60 but if you just want to do the ancient lands experience above ground only, 16, 14, and 8. But I would say, you've got to do this, guys. You have to do that. That's where the experience is. You have to explore the underground natural beauty of this cave. Lovely. 600 million year evolution. Lovely, lovely, lovely. Did I tell you how thoughtful people here are? Look at the waste beam. We always have to remember general waste, recycled waste. And this is the flower. Come see it. Jaran, yes, this is the flower I was telling you about. So this is how it is. And then when it dries up, it becomes like that. So you can keep it in the house for such a long time. Look at it. Oh my God. I love it. I love that flower. If it goes into your bouquet, it's just it's lovely. Hopefully. Yeah, it's one of the natives. We call them natives, the natives flowers. Natives. Right? It's pretty. Once it dries. So it starts yellow? Yeah, and then it dries. It dries yeah. And you say this can, it can for last, long, last forever. For, forever. You can, leave, you can keep it in your house. Oh, it's cute. Yeah, it's really nice. Almost like bottle brush? It's almost like bottle brush. Yeah, it's just a big old. Bigger form, stronger form, better form. Yeah. <laughs> so yeah.